Hey guys, what's up? It is Omar Zaki here, and today's video is going to be a little bit different from my normal ones. I want to talk about making things happen. There's a quote I like a lot by John Huertas that is, if you want something, you can't wait for someone to make it happen for you. I call this acting versus reacting. A person that has things happen to them is reacting. A person that is creating something, a person that is making things happen, that person is acting. Acting versus reacting. As you guys know, I make videos. Duh. <laughs> You're watching one right now. And I have a lot of goals and aspirations for myself, but one thing that I've always wanted is I've always wanted to be a Power Ranger. I loved the Power Rangers when I was growing up, and clearly I still like them now. And I decided some time ago, I said, you know what? I want to make a Power Ranger video. And I said, okay, what do I need? Well, I need a Power Ranger costume. So boom, I ordered a Power Ranger costume. And I'm lucky enough that I've got friends who are willing to help me out with some of the videos that I create. But even if I didn't have them, I still would have ordered the costume and made a Power Ranger video. I made that happen. Without my actions, that video never would have happened. And now, boom, done. I have two Power Ranger videos on the internet. So that's kind of advice for creating a product or a result. Next is creating a relationship. I'm talking more about a friendship in this one, but a friendship or something more even. There's a girl that I follow on Instagram, and her name is Samri Morez. Sorry, Sammy, I'm using you as an example. Hope it's okay. Um, and she's a super beast Taekwondo athlete. And yeah, I guess you could even call her an Instagram celebrity or whatever. And I wanted to get to know her. She seemed like a really cool person. And instead of looking at the two of us as two people of different statuses of fame, Instagram fame or whatever, um, with me down here with however many followers I have and she up there with however many followers she has, I instead looked at both of us as humans. I'm a human, she's a human. And I wanted to get to know this person. I wanted to communicate with her. So I sent her a message on Instagram. Easy enough, probably asking her about stretching or my kicking technique for Taekwondo. And because she is awesome, she responded. And then we started talking, we got to know each other. Boom, now we're friends, which is crazy. And it goes even further than that because when I was making my cross country trip from Washington DC to LA, I realized that I was going to be passing through the area that she lived in. And so I reached out to her again. I said, hey, I'm going to be passing through your area. Let's meet up. Let's film a video. Let's hang out, whatever. And then that happened. We got together. We filmed a video of us flipping and tricking. We got lunch together. We got to meet in person. And this is all because I made that happen. We were total strangers. She was, you know, in my head, an Instagram celebrity and I reached out to her. Then we became friends, we started talking, I reached out to her again, and then we met up and we made videos together. I made that happen. And yeah, you can't make everything happen, but if you try enough things, if you try to make enough things happen, eventually one of them will. And, and I don't want this to sound like bragging, I really hope it's not coming off that way. I just want people to have the courage to try for things that they want. Whether it's, it is meeting a new person, whether it's starting a business or getting a certain sponsor or it's learning a new skill. It starts with deciding what it is you want and instead of feeling intimidated or shy or whatever reason your brain concocts to keep you from doing that, just take the first step. Reach out to that person. Do some research on businesses or that particular business. Contact that potential sponsor. Try to learn that new skill. The way I look at it is, will you be in a worse place for trying? The answer 99% of the time is no. If, no. if you try and nothing happens, then you will be in the same place that you were. But at least you tried. Now if it goes the other way, and something does come of it, you're now in a better place because you tried. So you might as well try. I feel like I've had the most amazing things happen in my life 
already that seems so unlikely or impossible even but looking back on it it doesn't seem that like that unlikely anymore because I took as many steps as I could to make those certain things happen I took that initial step maybe I reached out to that person and then I followed up and I followed up again and again and I made that happen I did everything I could I tried to do everything that I could to make that happen You'd be surprised what happens when you try. Don't wait for things to happen, make them happen. That's my advice to you guys.